my wife found out that she's infertile and turned herself into a monk, now she's acting all shocked when I granted her wish to get it elsewhere. Basically, my wife has decided unilaterally that we are done having intimacy. She found out that she cannot have kids due to a choice she made before we met. And kids, apparently, are the only reason she was willing to have intimacy. I love my wife and I enjoy being intimate with her, but it was making our marriage untenable after two years of this. So I posted for advice. I started going for counseling for myself as well. But no matter how I approached her about our situation she would not try and see it from my point of view. Every discussion would end with her crying and screaming in my face that I was trying to manipulate her emotionally. I then wrote her a letter outlining my feelings and asking her to come with me for counseling, to seek it for herself, perhaps to see a doctor. I was kind and loving in the letter. The last thing I wanted to do was set her off. I worked on the wording with my counselor to make sure I wasn't saying anything aggressive that could be misinterpreted. She read the letter. Then she scrawled across it with her red sharpie. Go get it elsewhere because you are not getting it from me. Then she walked out. I sat there for about an hour doing nothing. Then I told myself that was what I was going to do. We are both fairly successful in our jobs. I'm not super attractive but fit and a good talker. It took a while but I met someone. We started as just friends, but it became physical. I made sure she knew I was married. She is not interested in a relationship, so I guess I am a safe option. My wife found out because I did not try and hide it. She was crying when I got home one night. When I came in, she asked if I was going to leave her. I said no. She asked if I was cheating on her, and I said I was getting intimacy elsewhere. She said that was cheating, and I did not disagree. I asked her what she wanted to do. She said I had to stop. I asked her if we were going to start having intimacy. She said I was an irrational asshole if I thought that she would have intimacy with me after I cheated. I went to my desk and pulled out a photocopy of the letter I had written with her answer in it. I went to have a shower and go to my room to sleep. When I woke up she was sitting on the couch waiting to talk. She said that she had reread the letter and realized she had not before. She assumed it was just a letter begging for intimacy. She said she would go for counseling alone and with me. All I had to do was stop having intimacy elsewhere. I said I would be willing to pause my friendship until we saw a counselor, and that if I saw progress in our relationship I would break it off. She said she would not agree to counseling without me leaving the other woman. It almost turned into a fight, so I just went for my run. Before I left, I asked her what would compel her to go to counseling if I stopped having intimacy elsewhere. When I got back, she still did not have an answer. She couldn't even say that our relationship was worth saving. I don't want a divorce, but I am willing to leave over this. I am 28, and I am not going the rest of my life without intimacy. She refuses to see my side. Update, I told my wife that I broke off my relationship with the woman I was having intimacy with. I did this because she said she would not agree to go to counseling unless I did so. She refused to go for counseling after I told her I broke off my relationship with my friend. She said I was her husband and that I didn't have the right to her body or to get intimacy elsewhere. Since I lied as a test I think you can guess I knew she was lying. We are getting divorced. She deserves to be happy with someone who is okay with no intimacy in the marriage and I deserve a life. I have moved out and am moving forward with my life.